Hey guys, me Randy, and so today I'm going to show you how to overlap your voice on Windows Live Movie Maker. I'm sorry that I'm just recording this on my camera. Um, I would use Jing, but turns out that you have to have Jing Pro to be able to upload them onto YouTube, which kind of sucks. But anyways, um, so yeah, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to want to do is, if you've already done a stop motion, you're going to click to get your photos up. Alright, so I this is actually a stop motion that I'm working on. Okay, so um, so here's the stop motion. Let's say I just wanted to overlap some voices. Okay? So the first thing I'm going to do is, so if you haven't seen my video on how to record your voice, um, just make sure you check my video out. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to record my voice um, then add it to the video. Alright, so I have added my video, or my audio track onto it. So now we're not gonna go, go ahead and save it up here. Just save pro project and I'll just call it test one. Okay, so that's not actually saving it. It's just a bunch of arrows pointing to all of these different, um, all these different videos here. I mean pictures. So, but when you go up to here, I'm on the I'm just on the regular home menu, and you're going to go to save movie, and for which one you do. So I'm doing high definition display, and it'll ask me where I want to save it, and I'll say test two. I'll hit save, and it won't take that long because it's just a short amount of pictures. And then, all right. So now we're going going to do is you're going to go to new project, and you're going to go when you click to go browse for pictures, go to where it says videos. Type in the file name of the one that you just made, the actual movie. It'll take a little bit to process this. Very quick. Okay. So now, as you can see, it has an empty audio track. So now I'm going to make a recording and overlap it. So as you can see, it has an audio track on top of there and it will sound like this. Um, Julie? So as you can hear, it um, has the humming in the background with Ivy's voice on top. Now you can do this as many times as you want. Um, like I could save this movie again. Call it test. Again, it won't take that long. So this already has the overlap, and I'm going to add another voice, and it will sound like this. So it's a lot of different, um, you can do as many voices as you want. So yeah, that's how you overlap voices. Uh, when does that movie maker? I just figured this out um, a few days ago. So yeah, hope this helps. Thanks for watching. Bye.